everybody welcome back to my youtube channel i know i'm super late on uploading um this video is definitely long overdue but anyway i'm recording for my bathroom because this video is going to be a tutorial well if it goes right it's going to be a tutorial if it doesn't go right it's going to be a what not to do because i guess i'll still upload it anyway so people can just learn from my mistakes and I can look back at it and learn from my own mistakes for the future. But anyway, so this video um, is going to be about me just applying my own um, false lashes. So I'm not a makeup person. I don't wear makeup all the time. Um, when I do, it's only for a special occasion. So the last time I had them, had my makeup done was for my senior pictures. And um, I did let the girl put lashes on me and um, I did like the way they looked and everything but this time I was like hmm let me try to you know do it on my own so anyway um, my friend she sells lashes so she sent me some and uh, shout out to her Drea um, anyway so in the packet this is how it comes you can see that it's a cute little bag and then on the inside is her business card so the name of her company is um emporium hair can y'all see that anyway and then um this is her contact information um i will definitely put that in my description box but anyway so she sent me um two separate kinds of lashes um don't remember what they're called but anyway um, here's one pack. I've already tried to take it off and um, try it on or whatever. Clearly it was unsuccessful. But anyway, this is the first pack. Now this one, um, she said these look more natural. So that's what I'm going for. I don't like having um, super long eyelashes because I can't see with them on. Honestly, my, first, my very first time wearing them, I couldn't see. But um, anyway, these are the second pair. Obviously a little bit more longer but yeah so i like the little package it comes in it kind of looks like a little diamond you can't see it that good but anyway it reminds me of a diamond but and then i've been told not to use um eyelash the whatever glue that you use like the lash glue um apparently that's like hard to come off so um Drea, the one that sent me the lashes, she told me to just um, buy like some um, glue from the hair store, which I guess, you know, what you use for your weave or whatever. So this is um, the kind that I decided to get. Um, it was like 99 cents. But anyway, so we're going to go ahead and get started. Let's see. If I can get it out the pack. Oh my goodness. I'm pretty sure I'm making this way harder than what it should be. But, oh, there we go. Ooh, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared, y'all. So, now I've watched a few tutorials on how to do it. Of course, um, that's not the same as actually doing it yourself. But um, I've heard that getting a uh, Q-tip and like putting the glue on the Q-tip is better than uh, just trying to put it on with the glue itself. So here's the lash. And then I'm gonna take, I'm gonna unscrew the glue. Here's my Q-tip. So I'm just gonna try to, oh, come, oh, it's not coming out. something I'm not doing right I'm pretty sure oh. oh it stinks okay it, this is hard to come out y'all it is not y'all what is going on this is not coming out let's see let me try and screw it no obviously they didn't give me the okay you know 
Seriously? That's fine with me. I'm gonna dip it because I just I'm I'm not doing it. I don't have time. Fuck with it. Oh, oh I got way too much. <laughs> anyway, let's see. We're gonna try no, which way is that? Which way is it? Is it this? Let's see that. Let me see y'all. Hold on. Get my life. Okay. Okay, I got it. Okay. So Is that enough? Or is that too much? Okay, I think that's enough. I really don't know. Let me get a piece of tissue. So, anyway, um, the first time when I was experimenting, I was just going to apply it directly to my eye um apparently you're not supposed to do that so they said you have to let it dry a little bit get a little tacky so i mean let's see i don't know it's supposed to be like sticky or something i'll let it dry a few more seconds i guess i don't know Cause I don't, I mean, I don't know how you, t we'll see, we'll, we'll try it. <clears throat> I am definitely struggling. I don't even, let me see. I'm pretty sure this is not even. Okay, the glue has dried. Oh, and it got all on. Okay, so the glue dries, so we're gonna try it again because I guess I'm taking too long. Let's see. Oh, I can get tweezers. Tweezers is supposed to help, but I'm just, Yeah, I think I'm gonna get some tweezers to help out because no ma'am. I cannot do this by myself. Definitely not. Okay, I got my handy dancing dandy tweezers. Let's see. Oh, this is no good. Okay, I'm gonna try it again. Put her on there. I don't know what she's doing over here. Y'all, I don't think this is right at all. Oh, I can't see. Oh, I can't see. We got feet. Oh, oh, check. Okay. Cause it's supposed to be like. Okay, this is obviously a uh, what not to do. Girl, look at, girl. This is, ooh, this is not going in my favor. Oh, it's not supposed to look. I don't think it's supposed to look like that. I don't, let's see. Because first of all, the glue has gotten all over my eyelid. This is, because see this part coming off. Okay. We're gonna, we're gonna do it again. Okay, so clearly um, it is a whole different day, um, but I got interrupted. So I just had to stop recording and then just come back and finish it up today. But anyway, as you can see, I finally got the lashes on.
I don't think I did too bad for my first time. Um, it was definitely a learning experience. And one thing I will say is um, putting on your own lashes is not for the weak. And I guess, you know, the more you start doing it, the more you get used to it. But right now, I'm still trying to get used to it. Um, I can't really see that well. But the more you wear them, I guess, the more you just kind of get adjusted to them. But anyway, thank you all for watching. Um, and I will see you all next time. Bye.